April Howard and I've had the distinct privilege of working with Ms. Chanda Palmer for many, many years. Ms. Palmer is an amazing leader. She is steadfast, committed, and she was the heart of the Eagle Nation when it first opened and continues to be. Thank you, Ms. Palmer, for your amazing dedication to the students of Jackson County, especially the Eagle Nation, and no one deserves a great retirement more than you. We love you and thank you. Hello, I'm Chanda Palmer, Principal of East Jackson High School, and we have two folks who are retiring from our teaching staff. The first is Michael Newton, and he has actually been in education for 34 years. He has spent time in Florida, in Tennessee, and in Georgia, and we are excited that he has chosen to do the last part of his career here with us at East Jackson. He's a certified social studies teacher as well as a driver's ed instructor. He's also been a head football coach and a defensive coordinator and plans to continue coaching even into his retirement. Also in his retirement, he plans to become a part-time landscaper. And he's going to do both of those jobs, both football and landscaping, with his sons, Colby and Chandler. He also has a daughter, Courtney. And he plans to spend time in his retirement tending his beautiful yard um, and spending many hours around the pool with his grandchildren. He has four grandchildren and another one on the way, so he's going to be very busy with that. Um, during his time here at East Jackson, he's been our credit recovery instructor, and he, along with his partner, Julie Bruce, have helped students recover credit for over 300 courses uh, just at spring break time this school year. So he has been a huge part of the stellar graduation rate that we have had here at East Jackson. I also value Mike in that he has great attendance and just an old school work ethic, and he will be sorely missed at East Jackson next year. Our second retiree is Anne Marie Willis, and she has spent 20 years of her career in Fulton County as a special education teacher, where she also served as the department chair there. And then she moved to East Jackson, where she has worked in our special education department, but most recently been a teacher of um, ESOL students. And she has been with us for eight years. She um, not only works really, really hard in the classroom, but she spends countless hours after school each week tutoring her ESOL students so that they can be successful in their other classes. And she says the students have been a joy to teach in such a supportive environment as EJCHS. In addition to those teaching responsibilities, she has also coached tennis for 17 years and was the region coach of the year three different times. She says, I will miss my students and colleagues, but I'm looking forward to being able to spend more time with my eight-month-old granddaughter in Nashville, as well as time with her daughter in Athens as they plan for the, her wedding next winter. So again, she'll stay very busy even in retirement as well. Anne Marie is one of the most genuine people that I have had the pleasure to work with. She always has a smile on her face, and if she comes to you with a problem or an issue, she always has a solution. Anne Marie will be sorely missed at East Jackson.